what I do, I try to tell a story. I love bright, bold colors. Bold colors represent energy. Bold colors represent something positive. Through my work over the years, I've noticed that I'm sending a message. There's so many things going on right now, so many negative things going on in the community, but there are also a lot of great positive things going on in the community. My name is Shirley Tucker. I am a 1989 graduate of Wright State University. I received my Bachelor of Fine Arts. I am currently the facilitator for our Helping Adolescents Achieve Long-Term Objectives Halo R program. Uh, through Montgomery County Juvenile Court. What color were you doing next? We do a lot of, of community projects and a lot of murals and other great activities throughout Dayton. What all are you doing? The circle and this one? Can you do the black? So I design the uh, artwork. I have my youth out here and basically I have them assigned to each panel and they're basically just using their talent and uh, painting and doing what they love doing. It's giving our kids that pride, you know, they're doing something positive. They're giving back to the community. It makes them feel a sense of something that they've actually have accomplished. When I was putting the mural together, I started reflecting about Wright State, the great relationships that I built at Wright State, the education and the art, and just the meaningful behind the university and how much it really touched me and how it prepared me to be the artist that I am. So I felt that it was important that I wanted to put just a little piece of my history, my education, and I wanted to represent Wright State. Okay, what you gonna do? You gonna do this, this wall right here. Being in probation, it was a win-win because not only am I taking kids out in the community and working with them, it's giving me a chance to live out my passion as an artist. When you're putting so much of your energy and your passion in what you're doing, at the end, when you see it come to life, you see it from the beginning, and then you see the finished product, it's a feeling I can't even explain. 